Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mobby. God dang it, we are back with more Terraria. The Epic Mod Pack Season 2, live streaming twitch.tv slash mod versus games. I'm getting a good amount of money here. So yeah. Um, last episode, we fought the Skeletron. We were kind of close to defeating him. In all honesty, we could have had it. We absolutely could have had it. But he just had to have that whole prefix of cryogenic. So if you didn't see that last episode, go check it out. My god, we fought him. I think we're seeing a bunch of new enemies here. It's probably... Yeah, I think there's a lot of new enemies. It's, it's probably doing that thing. Hey, lad broke. It's a fallen. Appreciate it, man. Look at that. Money pile? It's a money pile? Oh my god. I think we are seeing a bunch of new enemies. Depending on vanilla bosses that you kill, I think uh, new enemies pop up. And this happens in like some vanilla events, I think. But give me that money pile. Oh, the money pile, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, how much is it gonna drop? Like, like a thousand bucks? A thousand bucks? Mmm. Three gold. This is great. Okay, so it's about halfway through the night. Well, might as well fight the rest of this out. Um, so we're using one of two weapons right now. We're using the. What the heck is it called again? A caro, which is arrow carrots. It's not bad. I thought it was much better. It, you can see here it throws three projectiles, right? But actually when you hit with it, it only hits once. I'm not sure why that is. Because there are three projectiles and they do dissipate from each other. Hmm, probably because they all attack at the exact same time. But yeah, this, um... Is this a range weapon? It's a range weapon. Yeah, not that great. Not that great. We did pick up a little bit of new items here. Something called a Berserker chest plate. Uh, tons of monster souls ready to go. Yeah, I think that's one of the new enemies right there. The Berserker one. Berserker plate. Yes. I really want to get my wall of swag ready to go. So we're going to build a lot of mannequins. Well, we already have a bunch of mannequins. We're going to need the weapon th uh, wall thingies to put them all because I'm running out of room in my chest and let's be honest I'm gonna hoard everything I have here first time watching the Terraria stream Axel man congratulations actually welcome thank you thank you for being here bubbly blood moon warrior oh my god I got more bag of potentials yeah this weapon's I right. it's fine for a ranged weapon that doesn't actually use ammo it's weak as balls I probably you know, put it on a really high pedestal right before fighting the, um, what's his name? The, uh, uh, Skeletron, and we got just absolutely destroyed. Let's see what we got here. So, after this, we'll check, check all the new stuff we have. We need to chop down a lot of wood. Toxophobic Big Phantom! Big Phantom. Oh, this is, oh, this is actually pretty good. Uh, you remember, with the Phantom Souls, we're actually wearing the Phantom set, I think. No, we're wearing the Magma stuff. The Magma stuff. What does the magma one do again? Does that increase? Oh god, we're, we're close to death. I need to activate Eliminate here to increase our um, regeneration rate. We're about to be jumped. I see him! I see him! Ah, nice try, buddy. Oh, I wish this weapon swung faster. But I guess it'd be too good. Okay. Mm, some orcs. Ooh, look at that. A blood heart. Equipable. Gives you a chance of to steal life on enemy hit. Now, I'm all for really, really new and fun mod items but with a very very vague description like that and i don't know if there's a certain wikipedia for that for that mod i don't know what mod it's on but it says a chance if it told me the exact chance i would be more inclined to use it or not right now it's more on the not side because it what if it's like a two percent chance it's like what's the point right so it's not a material but it is a cool equipment so we'll probably just be holding on to that what is this a mini what is this mini meteorite what are, what's with all these new items we're seeing here? We got a dark druid. Dark druids! What bosses? Oh! Uh, okay, we did kill two vanilla bosses before another blood moon, which was the Eater of Worlds. And... Two of... Well, we killed like five of them or something. It was the, um... The Eye of Cthulhu, so we killed a bunch of those. Which is leading me to believe that's why there's a bunch of new enemies in the blood moon. Uh, so cool. I was I was thinking of skipping right over it, the blood moon that is, but I'm glad we're fighting it now. Let's go ahead and just quick stack a lot of stuff. We're running out of room. Oh, I see a bunch of new items there. It's good how the quick stack works though. If we have any new items, it's obviously not going to get put into the chest because there's nothing to stack it onto. 
so that's pretty good. Broken Invaw Shields. We have so many of those. Yeah, we learned... What is that? Gloom Tomb. It's the second Gloom Tomb. This seems to be a regular one, though. Hopefully, it sells for a lot. I missed the book. Oh, we, we, we found it. I picked it up. Thanks for that. Uh, yeah, the delay. It was, like, short delay. But that's cool. Fire away. Fire away. Phantom Souls. I wish the Blood Moon was would be over already, but we have so much... We actually have a lot of bags of potential and we still need 400 health total so we want to go digging in the underground trying to find the extractinator i'm not sure because you know in the mod with, with the crazy mod i have you should be able to craft a lot of items but i'm not sure if you can craft extractinator we're gonna, we're gonna have to keep looking around so wood extractinator to be able to use all of our bags of potential and there was other ones just like it not today damn you eric damn you yeah it's just a, it's, hey, you know what's going on, you know. All right, oh, inventory's full again. All right, just whatever, just keep quick stacking. It's all bueno. Pyrophobic Undead Warrior, even though all these guys have crazy prefixes, we're actually handling them pretty well. Can't wait to get the extractor. I want it, I want it bad, I don't know how to get it. Well, we, we have to get luck and find it. There has to be one in every world, right, at the very least. I mean, how unlucky can you get to not have one, right? All right. Ah, it's morning. Perfect. All right, let's kill this last toxophobic thingy, majiggy. Yeah, this, this weapon, I thought it was good. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. It's just not what I was expecting. If it did triple damage, that'd be good. Okay, so let's once again quick stack, and let's see what we got. We got the blood heart, so we're going to get rid of that. Mini meteorite. Right click for bars. Okay. Eh. Two, 12 silver bars. Okay, meteorite ore, that's fine. And we got um, blood. It's just blood, material. Who knows Who knows how you're holding it? In your hand? In your hand? I don't know. All right, so let's see what we can turn it into. We, the only thing we could turn it into are vials of blood. So two equals one vial of blood. We should probably craft that and see what happens. We have a bunch of magma ore, blah, 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 blah. Magma cores. It's been a while since I last played, so I don't know exactly what we need. I think uh, the talent burst might be better than the, than the carrot, actually. Even though this is only eight, it use it fires twice and it fires a lot more faster. So I th think we're gonna be using the the talent burst. Let's go ahead and try this out really quick. Yeah, look at that. That's pretty good. And remember, we are using the menacing ranger level five class, so we'll be working towards that. Uh, so let's go get a bunch of wood and stuff, putting the blood heart away. Orcish Breastplate. This is a new armor. Um, hopefully we can do a lot more blood moons. I think that's the only way to get blood as well. And we can finish off the rest of this. Okay, we have some silver zombie banner. I'm just going to put here. All right, let's, let's get out of here. Oh, wait, we got a new weapon. Orcish Knife. 60 melee damage, very fast speed. Oh, that is, that is very gross. Look at that. That range, that attack damage... It's pretty bad. Probably not gonna use that. Nightingale Greaves. So yeah, Nightingale Greaves was good, but yes, this magma one is good. Bursting with heat, melee damage all around. Thirty damage or the twenty-seven. I I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this one better. Okay, empty out our inventory. You know, get the heck out of here. We have three hundred and forty-six wood. Actually, we have a lot of wood. I thought I needed more, but we're okay. We can craft. Um, going to our crafting saw thingy area here let's make a bunch of weapon racks uh, I think 20 should be good for now it's like a super copper short sword that's exactly what it is <laughs> pretty much I, I don't know the exact damage of the copper short sword but it can't be as good as this freaking knife uh, as orc one right all right let's drop these wool mannequins down here uh, I'm, I'm gonna try my hardest to put them in order of how I wore them but I'm assuming after a while we're just going to craft them just to craft them and it's not going to look good. But look at this set right here. That looks absolutely awesome. The one I'm wearing is cool too, but this is a really awesome contrast. It looks great too. Uh, weapon racks. I was put it right above it, I suppose. Weapon racks. Ah, uh, yes. The weapon of the racks right here. Uh, hopefully spacing them out well. I'm going to have to fix that. Man... It, it, it took a lot of effort to craft this vampire slime staff, but this guy doesn't actually do a lot for us, does he? No, he's pretty bad. All right, two, three. So we're going to put three in between, and then we're just going to keep 
I'm putting a torch there. One, two, three. Uh, when it reaches the end, it's most likely not going to fit exactly how it is on the left side. One, two, three. So sorry for you OCD people out there, but it's going to happen. You can find extractors in the underground desert. You know what? It's funny. We haven't even been to our underground desert yet, which is right here. We'll head there soon. We'll head there soon. We will head there soon. Um, let's see. One, two, three. Yep. It's not going to fit in the exact fashion. What the heck? An another mini meteorite? I thought I heard two. It sounded like more than one. Where are these popping up from? We got some lead bars. 16 of them. That's interesting. Cool. I'll, I'll take that. Why the hell not? All right. So, <laughs> Jesus. Let's put the caro away. I don't want to use this anymore. Uh, caro. Oh. Oh, okay. Um. What the heck? Unreal iron hammer. Where'd my caro go? Iron hammer? My caro disappeared. My caro disappeared. Oh, no. Are you telling me I can't put modded items on here? Axel, have a good night, dude. What the hell? Oh, no. Mm. My caro disappeared. I mean, it's easily purchasable, but maybe some items just can't be put on here. Let's try this arachnophobia. No, I can't put it on there. How are we supposed to show all this stuff on the wall of swag? It's gone. It's gone. Well, that goes my plan. What the fuck? Do you throw it away or put it in a chest? No. As you can see here, I just put on the other item and it just disappeared. That sucks, guys. That really sucks. I wanted to make a giant wall of swag. Um, maybe the item frames will still work, but it seems like the weapon racks just... It's not going to work with the modded items. Oh, that sucks. Hmm. Maybe, however, we can... Mm, just just maybe just maybe we can put these on here instead uh, well, let's do this let's do this to let's just stack it up so we're gonna have like a nice little row of weapon racks I guess I could put vanilla items and then we'll have these ones it sucks you can't put them yeah let's go grab another um, weapon I'm not going to use that's modded um, like this orcish one this one for sure you, I, I lost them permanently, it looks like it, but it's fine. I wasn't going to use them. If I can use these on the item ones, then that would be cool. You can. But maybe this one would have worked on here anyway. Let's see. All right. Found out the problem to fix that shit. I got plumber's pants off that. Well then. Mamma mia. Mamma mia, papa mia. It looks like we're going to be putting all of our items on item racks instead. Which is good. It's fine. It saves so much more room. I guess. <laughs> but at least we found out a way to do it. Alright. Um, I will put all that stuff later. In between episodes. Right now. Let us put away, I guess, this item drop here. And uh, lemons. We can just turn into the lemonade. We don't need anything special, right? No, 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 no. Decorative lemonade sounds great, though. But it's okay. Alright, we're Gucci. With everything we have here, it's fine. Spiky balls. I'm gonna I'm gonna sell these spiky balls. I have a lot of money on me, let's not forget that. Candy bow! Snow shotgun. The traveling merchant has arrived. Perfect, I got a lot of money. I've got uh, almost platinum. Alright, let's see what he has here. Do, 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 do. We got uh, Angel Halo. I really want this. Really want this. But it's okay. Code one, extendo grip, fez, a diamond ring, a dynasty, shingles. I don't, I mean, all, all these would be really nice to have, but we're kind of poor right now. Two platinum for the diamond ring. Actually, I think we need the extendo grip. I'm not sure if we already, you know, have an extendo already, but there you go. Okay, let's go to the whatever area. How many do we have? We have 40. It's another mini meteorite. I think I'll just hold on to these. I don't want to. Uh, okay. I hate these things. I have too much of these already. I'm going to try to not break them if possible. A second mini meteorite. This, no, this is the first, fourth one that we find. Apostle Killer. Oh, man. That name. I used to follow him. I'll go to the mom and the family, bro. Yeah, these purple tulips. Aha! Uh -huh, slice. 
We only did like 20 damage, even though this is 27, and we have this big buff of 13% more damage. It's not really working. To the desert, guys. To the desert. It's going to be fun. First time uh, digging under there. Let's see what's going on. Actually, the little pet kind of works well with our um, with our armor. Looks pretty cool. Here we go. Ah! Okay, first time here. Wouldn't that be awesome we found a Shrek in here right away? All right, we have a bunch of... All right, Antlion Swarmer, let's go. Yeah, you got wrecked. Let's see what's in this chest. We found Umbrella, which is going to be used in the item area, and Silver, and that's it. Don't want any of this. Actually, the wooden... No, it's good. Jesus, what's with all the enemies doing whatever down here? Ah, slices! All right. This is going to be interesting. Uh, I don't think I can get the uh, that fossils yet. Those crazy fossils, huh? Look at that. Trickster Colossal Antlion Swarmer. Colossal Antlion Swarmer. And he died like like, like nothing. <laughs> he got wrecked so easy. Alright, let's keep on Go. Oh my god, why are there so many enemies? Alright, I gotta activate another apple pie. Sorry, I gotta activate lemonade. It's fine. And more monster souls for the win. You will probably find an extract in here. Boy, I sure hope so. Oh, this is copper? I thought it was the uh, fossil thing. Alright, we're gonna keep surging down here. But for now, I'm gonna have the end episode. Yeah, if you enjoyed, leave a like, it helps so much. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Play a lot of daily videos. Make sure to come by the live stream so you don't miss anything. You don't have to wait for it. Twitch.tv slash Games. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.